So what is the next big thing for searching e-commerce? Let's put it that way. Next big thing, searching e-commerce. That's a good question. I think there's a lot of really interesting things happening in the realms of vector search. Mm -hmm. um, we we do a little bit of that stuff. Uh, when when you like get into the nuts and bolts of how Constructor works, it's more of an ensemble model. Yep. Without getting too much into those, but the, the yeah. Anyways, um, we use mostly ensemble models. Uh, one of the pieces of the ensemble model is already vector search, but I think as time goes on more and more vector search will become the, the standard. And the reason for it is you can, one of the big problems in e-commerce search is if you're doing like the basic keyword matching, the traditional keyword matching, mm -hmm. you're matching on keywords that happen to exist in a term, but aren't really relevant uh, to, to that product. Mm -hmm. so I know this is like somebody searching for an iPhone and getting an iPhone case. Like, does it have that word iPhone? Sure it does. But um you've got this other piece that adds different meaning to it, that, that yep. case word. If you're looking at vector search and you start looking into embeddings, um, which I won't go too much into here, but uh, you're basically learning about the words that are neighboring each individual word, giving it context. As you start doing that, you start solving that problem of um, those irrelevant results that are coming mm -hmm. back just based off of keyword matching in a very automated way. That, And this is the, the best part, is language agnostic. Okay. Um, to, to me, like those are that, that's where things head in the future. Like Right now, you've got all of these great models that a lot of folks use for independent languages. And mm -hmm. so they wind up being like really great in English, for example. But then as soon as you move it to Polish, like the thing doesn't work. Yep. The more you build this stuff in a language agnostic way, uh, the more you can serve your customers, you can serve their many languages, and um, you can do more of this stuff automatically instead of relying on these like very custom-built models. Awesome. Thank you.